These Israeli reservists are adding their names to a declaration that says they'll no longer report for active duty in protest against the government's proposed judicial changes. They're among a growing number of pilots, soldiers and intelligence officers who say they're acting on principle. I came here today to sign to convey the message that I will not serve a dictator, I will not serve in a dictatorship. I'm here to say that my kids won't grow up in a, in a dictatorship, in a place that abolishes the basic human rights of equality. Military service is compulsory for most Jewish men and women above the age of 18, and many volunteer for reserve duty well into their 40s. Reservists reinforce the regular Army, Navy and Air Force. In an emergency, Israel can order its entire reserve force, numbering more than 400,000, to report for duty. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu says the government will not tolerate insubordination. Refusal to serve puts the security of all Israeli citizens at risk. The government will not accept refusal. The government will act against it and will take all necessary steps to ensure our security and our future. Hundreds of Israeli reserve pilots first joined the demonstrations against the government in March by refusing to report for duty. Last week, 400 more announced similar action alongside air traffic controllers and drone operators. Commentators say it's significant because the Air Force is largely made up of the Israeli elite. The protest of, of, of the army officers, but mainly the pilots, is almost a game changer and might, might stop the legislation. It's not only that they are pilots, but usually they come from the well of social uh, classes, from the right places, from the right ethnic origin, and uh, they are quite powerful. Protests against the government's plans to change the legal system show no signs of slowing down. Israel's army chief has warned Netanyahu his proposed changes could affect the readiness of the army. Victoria Gatenby, Al Jazeera. It's been 100 days since fighting first